Hey guys, welcome back to another Minecraft video. Today we're gonna take a look at another Mo Mongolian yurt, and the second one is an upgraded version from the first one. Um, so I'm gonna tell you right now what I've changed, uh, actually what I added. So first let's take a look at this one, just so you can uh, remember it from the last video. And here is the second one, the new one. Also, there's a place for horses now up up there. And yeah, so as you can see, I've added these ropes around. And those are rail metadatas. And if you're wondering how are they floating in air, that's because I have disabled physics and now they items can float so yeah that's what it changed actually that's what I added that's for um, support for this tent so it's stabilized and secure and I changed interior of course this is a different design so again there are beds there's a place to prepare food um, there's some food there in the crate there's a lot of um, these so they can keep their clothes or other items in here is table and some seats where they can eat and this is what I changed again up here is like a this is for support I don't know how it's called mm. it's like when you see and when you turn your umbrella upside down you can see um, a lot of small thingies going in each direction so I don't know how it's called but anyways um, here's another furnace uh, this is a different one but I don't know what else could I add um, instead of furnace because um, I think that live fire inside would be bad I'm not sure if, they, if, if that's what I had inside I know I saw some furnaces but they were much uh, simpler, probably lightweight, because these yurts are designed to be moved, so they can just pack it on horses and move. And yeah, that's basically it. that's all the changes. Basically, what I added and changed is this. these supports and the supports inside, these ropes and the small thing inside that I don't don't know how it's called. And I changed the furnace and the chimney now it's a bit thinner and it looks more lightweight. So thank you all for watching. I hope that you liked it. If you did, please leave a like on the video. And if you're interested in my channel and work, then please subscribe. And also I created Twitter. I don't know if I'm actually going to use it much. And... I'm probably going to post some things that I work on and like that so you, you can check it out. The link will be in description and as well on my channel page so check it out. Until next time, goodbye.